Hello everyone and welcome to Mountain Lake Journal. I'm Tom Halley. This week, a new era begins here at Plattsburgh International Airport. The airport held a ribbon cutting to celebrate the first United Express flight arriving and receiving a ceremonial water cannon salute as the jet pulled up to the terminal. The airline, operated by SkyWest, took over the airport's essential air services agreement and will offer two non-stop daily flights on weekdays and a daily flight on weekends to Dulles International Airport in Washington. Chamber of Commerce President Gary Douglas says the new service is the next step in the vision started a dozen years ago to offer an alternative to air travelers from Montreal, a cheaper secondary option, and non-stop flights to vacation destinations. We began with low-cost flights to vacation destinations, the Allegiance, uh, the Spirits, Direct Air, uh, because that, those were the easiest ones to draw in, and they were the risk takers who will test a market like this to reach Montreal and could prove that this, this airport could have that kind of market reach, generate sustained numbers over a period of time. And we saw that as, a, as one of the pathways to eventually make the successful case to someone like United Express. United says the new 50-seat passenger jets and daily flights will connect the North Country and Montreal to major routes and cities worldwide. We're really excited to give you the uh, uh, our hub at Washington Dulles Airport where we have over 70 domestic destinations we serve and nearly 40 international destinations. Thanks to the global network of United Airlines, local residents and, and our neighbors visiting from the north will have access to one of the largest international airports in the country. This new jet service will create endless opportunities to improve the bustling economy of the north country and will allow customers to reach destinations throughout the world. Among the first passengers on the very first flight were Rochelle Helsner and Robert Agus, who live just outside of Washington but own a summer camp on Loon Lake. Sometimes we've flown into Burlington, uh, sometimes we've flown into Albany. Um, most of the time we've driven the nine and a half hours, which is grueling. So this is perfect. Um, we will go to Dulles, to Plattsburgh. It will take us less than an hour to get to our camp. The airport hopes its multi-million dollar expansion and the opening of its new International Arrival Center and U.S. Customs later this year will draw interest from other airlines looking to offer flights to the Caribbean or possibly even Europe and make Plattsburgh a destination for international flights like those that will bring athletes to compete in the World University Games in Lake Placid in 2023. Clinton County chose United Express and SkyWest Airlines to replace Penn Air's flights to Boston. The airline will receive about $6 million in federal essential air service subsidies to provide the daily flights to D.C. So far, it has hired more than a dozen part and full-time employees to work as the ground crew in Plattsburgh. 